Edinburgh, a thriving city in which rugby has taken a strong hold, especially for one youngster from Edinburgh College's rugby development programme. I'm here today to meet the young star who's been capped to play for Scotland's under-20s team. The developing sports performance course at Edinburgh College is aimed at school leavers who have played at district or national level to further develop their skills in a full-time structured course. I managed to catch up with the sports performance lecturer Robert Christie to learn more. The uh, course has been running for 10 years now. Um, first of all, it was set up by a guy called Murray Craig, um, who, who kind of started the whole thing along with the sports department, and then I've, I've kind of taken that lead role over for the last five years. Uh, how do you think the rugby performance course helps players improve? Um, it, it, allows them, it allows them time, if I'm being completely honest, to work on their individual skills. Um, the course is very individually individual based, I suppose, um, and, it, and it allows them to really develop the skills that they need for their, their positions and, and, and work on their weaknesses as well. Uh, would you recommend the rugby performance course to future players looking to improve their skills? Yeah, I'll look at you know, I haven't played the game as well. I, I think it's uh, it's 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 ideal for guys that are really keen to develop the the, the rugby. Um, it gives them a full year, pretty much being a full time rugby player, with an academic element with Edinburgh College. A few of the students from this course have definitely made a large impression as the Scottish under-20s team has called one of them up to play at national level and another to train with the Scotland national squad. The player in question is Curry scrum half Charlie Shield, who has already had three caps for Scotland playing with their under-18s, under-17s and under-16s team. He was also a part of the Scotland under-20s team that beat England recently 24-6. How does it feel to be called up to the national level for the under 20s team? Yeah, it's been, I mean, it's an unreal experience, especially getting called up for your national side out of the amount of boys that are in Scotland as well. Um, it's a real honour um, and it's been been good past couple of weeks and good experience as well. How do you find the uh, Edinburgh College Rugby Development Programme in uh, developing your skills? Yeah, uh, the course has been a massive help. Um, past well half, half year I've been on the course, it's been Master help just getting in the hours, doing extra extra bits, get the skills in as well, um, and also just getting a bit of experience of what it's like to be a pro rugby player as well, for, uh, training full time. So it's been good. I also spoke with a few of the other students to get their thoughts on the course. Uh, it's it's good fun. Um, just straight from the off, you meet uh, a whole new bunch of boys that uh, automatically get on with because you've got common interests. Uh, obviously, rugby is the main feature of it, so you're obviously just straight into it and getting on with it straight away. Uh, it really helps you develop the skills, so um, it's really good in terms of that, and it's also really varied as well, so it's not it's not only just rugby, it's like strength conditioning, it's analysis work as well, and there's a bit of judo and swimming mixed in with it as well. So, I'd like to wish Charlie the best with his future with the under-20s team. This is Dylan Holmes, signing off.